Jet. Why Joe here today? So today we are coming at you with the San Francisco vlog. So this is gonna have nothing you get related whatsoever. It's just gonna be me enjoying my time. You guys are gonna see a little bit of my lifestyle when I'm coming around here. Um, we've already been here for like the whole day, pretty much. So um, yeah, my phone, our flight was at like five in the morning. My phone died while I was watching uh, Million Dollar List in New York on the flight. Uh, so yeah, I just enjoyed the rest of my day, charged it when I got back and I'm carrying it on here. But I'll film little gimmicks and stuff as the days go on. For now, we're just gonna go get sushi. Um, we both have some weird sleep from uh, the hour shift, so probably gonna stay up to like nine this time tonight and just pass out and enjoy the rest of my day. So we'll see you the remainder of the vlog. One second, let me... Okay guys, so we are now, uh, it's the next day. We're currently in Fisherman's Wharf. It's pretty cool here. Um, this is where you can see like the, uh, the bridge, like the big red bridge in Alcatraz. And uh, yeah, so we're right on the pier right now. You can see all of it. Um, yeah, I'll show you a few video shots in a second. This guy was above the water the whole time. Okay guys, so it is the next day from those clips you guys just seen. We went to Golden Gate Park. I didn't really film any like um, stuff leading up to it or before. Kind of give you guys a bit of a story. We went to Golden Gate Park. Uh, pretty cool. They had like tree observatories or whatever. It's like 55 acres of um, like trees from all over the world. Um, <laughs> oh, botanical garden. So that's what that was. Um, still need to brush my teeth. Uh, so does my girlfriend. We're probably going to go for a walk to Starbucks. Anyways, uh, I wanted to just tell you what happened. Um, we went there kind of underestimated how big the actual Golden Gate Park was. We wanted to go to the beach and we just kept walking and walking. And I think we walked like, we walked like miles and we finally got there and we like sat at the beach. And unfortunately there was like no food and it was like seven. So like in our, in our time, that's like 10 PM. And we're still like, I mean, we're fine now, but I mean like it's not too hard to get used to a three hour time change, but yeah, then we decided to walk back. And for some reason it's all residential. There's no like places to eat by a beach for some reason. So we gave up and we have data charges if we have to use data because so, there's no wi-fi so we had to use like a data charge to get an uber to come pick us up and then we we have make up we're right in union square so we got we just went to mcdonald's and i got like a mcchick or no mccrispy and uh and a milkshake and small fries there's small portions in the states are like normal size but i know when you get like medium and large it's just like absurd so we just didn't do that. Um, so yeah, we came back. Uh, they didn't put any sauce on my McCrispy. I don't know if it's supposed to come with sauce now, but it was literally just the crispy chicken and the pickles. <laughs> so dumb. And they didn't give me the sauce I wanted. So anyways, that's how yesterday went. It's a bread. Okay guys, so we just came back. Um, we were out from like 8.30 um, over by one of the piers. Um, yeah, we just kind of did a bunch of stuff. If you've seen all those uh, little flicks and then uh, I didn't film us. Fire trucks were really loud. I didn't film us going to Adidas, but yeah, got some new Ultra Boosts. 
Um, needed some new ones. They're not the Japan ones, but the, these will work. Just clean. I like my favorite shoe. I use them, I'm a realtor, so I use them like for door knocking uh, primarily. Um, and just keep them clean so I look professional at the same time. So, yeah, anyways, we're gonna go. So we're on the we're on our way to uh, Deer Woods. Um, we're stopping through this place called Solisto, which is pretty cool. As you see, I just uh, I just parked, and we're gonna go find some place to have some lunch. And uh, yeah, my girlfriend just said this is a cool place. So I have no clue. Okay, so we sat down at this Italian restaurant for lunch. It's really nice here. There's just sailboats and everything here. And I, what do you think? This is like the beach town of of uh, San Francisco, maybe. It's the least. It's the least, though. So, yeah, we're here. Um, we're going to be going to Muir Woods after. Yeah, interesting thing that happened today. I had a. Uh, it's funny because they say in real estate, like, the less you work, the more business you get. Sometimes it's just like that. And the harder you work, you sometimes you get no business. I just had two people call me, one to as a buyer referral and the other one to list her home in the next month or two so yeah just on vacation you know had two closings coming in it's real estate man <laughs> so anyways i'll show you my food here Ooh, la, la. nice shades Hello. <laughs> we have completed the walk. It was about seven miles. And we made it to the road. Stop for our coffee break in uh, Little Italy. Just before uh, we have a, a Alcatraz at, at 1 p.m., so that'll be pretty cool. So um, yeah, just gonna be hanging out around here. We're gonna go back to the seal place, and uh, yeah, we'll, we'll just see you on the ship. I guess that's probably the next time we're gonna. Go. Stop some music when you start. Oh, is this from my vlog? Yes. Do you want a video? Seals, not too many out today. Seals, the last one we were in.
of those. Yeah. There's some video over there. You can find them. Oh. There he is right there. There's another sunbather. Right there. Hello. Let's go in the water. Okay, so we just came across this. We're gonna just wait to see what it is. <laughs> oh my god, is it first edition? No. It's just like the video game, the Black Ops Zombies map. It's just like the map on Black Ops Zombies. This is what Viking here is like the whole time. We have made it to our destination under the bridge. Okay, so if you just seen we are in the Museum of Art San Francisco. It's gonna be pretty cool in here, so I'll shoot like a couple clips along while we're going through here, so. Being kissers. Okay, guys, so we are finally back from San Francisco. It was a really good time. That was the first time I've actually been on like an out of country vacation outside of like business trips, like uh, for real estate and stuff. Like, there was a couple that happened in the States. Um, but ever since COVID, this is like our first like out of the country vacation. So that was pretty awesome. Uh, felt really good to just uh, be in that kind of vicinity again, like uh, like how many people and uh, just walk around 
you know, without any restrictions pretty much. So that felt really good. Um, yeah, so we're, now we're back home. I just didn't really feel like filming the last day because we had a flight at five. Um, so we had to be at the airport for like 2.30. Um, yeah, I just didn't even bother filming that day because we just came home and uh, yeah, it's now the next day and we got Miss Eve. There she is. Hey, Miss Eve. She's really happy to be home. So yeah, so hope you guys like the vlog. Um, to wrap it all up, it was a good time. Uh, had fun driving the car around the whole time I was there. Had fun seeing the seals. Um, yeah, overall, like, I mean, this is just kind of like a big summary of like, like life doesn't gotta be about, all about Yu-Gi-Oh, man. Like you don't gotta take it super competitive. I mean, like, yeah, take it competitive for sure. But I mean, like, I think some people focus too much on the game itself. Just take some time to just enjoy life, man. Like that's a, it's at the end of the day, it's just a card game. Just gotta go out and just enjoy life, right? So at the end of the day, that it's not gonna pay you, right? So um, uh, Yu-Gi-Oh is super fun. It's definitely like my biggest hobby. Um, I mean, but this was just like a good, I felt like just posting a vlog like this was also just good for people to see like, hey, there's like a lifestyle you can have outside of it, right? Especially for someone like me who's known as a Yugi tuber. So yeah, it was a good time. And uh, yeah, hope you guys like that. I will see you guys in the next video, which is probably gonna be uh, for the Toronto Regionals, which is coming up in a couple of weeks. So yeah, we'll see you in the next one. And don't forget, stay jacked.